Hey guys, it's HRC's Creative Corner. Today we're going to teach you how to paint a sunset. For this you'll need a piece of paper, some water to clean your brushes, um, a pencil, we're using Paper Mate. You'll need a few brushes, a palette or some somewhere to keep your paint on, some painter's tape or normal tape, and your warm colors of paint and your cool colors. For this, we used apple barrels and craft smart. You want to cut your paper into a square. Get your pencil and let's get to sketching. First, you want to create some mountains. You can make them different heights and lengths when you do it. I'm probably going to make some small ones and some big ones to make it look nicer. And sometimes you can just have a bit, really big one like this. So after you're done your mountains, you want to make a circle for where the sun will be. After you have the circle, you want to take the tape. So we just picked out four colors. We need a dark red, an orange, um, a lighter pale yellow, and a bright yellow. First you want to take some red paint, and you want to start painting at the top of the paper. After you do that, you want to wash your brush. Then you want to take some orange paint and lightly fade it with it. You know what? I can't! I just painted the red and I went over it with some orange paint to make it blend together. Then you want to take some orange on a separate part of the palette and mix it with a bit of yellow to get a lighter shade of orange. Then you want to take it and blend it. As you see, it's getting to more of a sunset, like corally orange color. Then you want to take more and you want to make sure you blend it over the paint or it won't blend good. You want to make it go over the layers you've done before so it goes more evenly. So you want to do it every part around the sun. It's fine if you paint over the sun because you're, it's covered with tape, so it's fine. So after you go over it, see, I'm taking the orange paint and going over the red so it blends together or it won't look good. So as you see, I just blended it and I left a bit of red tint at the top. After you do that, you want to take your brush, wipe it, and take the orange paint out because you're going to be going in with more of a yellow than orange, but it has a bit of orange tint. So you want to start with this and you want to just blend it over. See, you can see that it has a bit of an orange tint to it. And as you can see, just make sure to avoid the mountains. So you're going to go a bit more down so you don't go over the mountains. But as you can see, we're here. So go this low first and stop here. Now you want to take a rounded point, you want to take a rounded pointed medium brush. You want to dip your yellow in and go over around the mountains so you don't go over it. Make sure you're painting in one direction so it doesn't look weird. And now you want to get rid of the orange tint in the yellow and use just yellow. And then you want to do that to the rest of the mountain. 
Then you want to go in with a small rounded brush to do the sun. So first, you want to take the tape off your sun. And see, no paint got on it. So you take your tape out. Then, as you can see, got a little messed up there. So we're going to go in with our medium brush and just take a bit of red orange. And just blend it in with the background. So after you did that, you want to take your light yellow, the pale yellow, and you want to go in and do the sun. As you can see, it's different than the bright yellow we've put here. And you just want to fill in your beautiful sun. And you don't want to leave any white spaces so you can paint over. So now you have your sun. For your mountains, you're going to take black paint. So you want to take the black paint, put it in the palette. You'll need about this much. Then you want to take a medium straight brush. Take your black paint and you want to paint in the mountains because this is kind of like a silhouette of a mountain during the daytime. This is our finished product of our sunset. Thanks for watching. See you in our next video.